Hey guys, it's Megan. So welcome to episode 3 of my 5 ways to fill a sketchbook series. I'm not going to talk too long for this intro, so let's just get into it. The first idea is to find clothing in magazines. I'm using these swimsuits that I found in a magazine and cut them out and design characters around them. I drew these six girls wearing bathing suits and I drew them in a very simplistic cartoon style and then I just colored them in and then I was done. So here's how the finished drawing turned out. I really love this idea because if you're like me and you can't really think of like outfit ideas, this is perfect. And I don't know, I just think that it looks really cool. My next idea is to draw pictures based on fortunes that you get out of fortune cookies. And we get Chinese all the time and we like never eat the fortune cookies. So we just had a bunch of like fortune cookies laying around. So I went ahead and opened a bunch of them and then I picked the fortunes that I could think of an idea to draw for. And I divided my paper into four sections. So I had eight sections in total. And then I just went ahead and glued down the fortunes. So once I had my fortunes glued down, I drew a little cartoon to go with each fortune. So this one says, loving is sharing rainbows of happiness. So I drew a girl with a rainbow and some hearts. And the next one says, you need to recharge, spend time alone in nature. So I drew this girl with a flower crown and she's just like chilling in nature. The next one said, eat, drink, and be merry for tomorrow you may diet. So I went ahead and drew a girl that's like eating a bunch of food. And then the next one said, next time order the shrimp. So I drew some shrimp. The next fortune said, imagination is everything. It is the preview of life's coming attractions. So I drew a movie theater and on the screen it's showing the previews and it says coming soon. And the next one said, it's not only important to add years to your life, but to add life to your years. And I interpreted this one as like, you should like travel and get out and stuff. So I drew an airplane. The next one said, human evolution, wider freeways, but narrower viewpoints. So for this one, I decided to draw a lady in her car and she's just rolling her eyes about something. Maybe she's like talking on her phone or something and I don't know. And the last one, it says, one of the first things you should look for in a problem is the positive side. So for this one, I drew a girl with binoculars because she's like looking for the positive side. The next idea is to use colors from magazines to create an element in your drawing. So for this drawing, I drew a girl and she's holding an umbrella and I cut out pieces that were blue from a magazine to create raindrops. First, I colored in the drawing with my Winsor & Newton Pro markers and I did the background with this gray acrylic paint. Then I went through a bunch of magazines and cut out any pieces that were blue and then I cut them into these raindrop shapes. I just used a regular Elmer's glue stick to attach them to the page. I also decided to cut out a quote from a book to add to this page, and that's another thing that you can do in your sketchbook, is to use old books and cut out a quote from them. So I used the book Girl Interrupted, and I cut out the quote that every window on Alcatraz has a view of San Francisco, and I thought it went well with this drawing because the girl, she's like standing in the rain and she's frowning, but she's like looking at a rainbow, which is why there's a rainbow in her sunglasses. I'm not really sure if that makes sense, but like it makes sense to me, so I guess that's really all that matters. The next idea is just to make a regular old collage. So for this collage, I decided to cut out a bunch of watches from magazines. And there are honestly a lot of like ads for watches in magazines, so I f was able to find these pretty quickly. I wanted to include a quote about time over the watches. So I used my label maker to write out the past is far behind us, the future doesn't exist. And like you'd think that this was really deep or something, but no, it's really just from Don't Hug Me, I'm Scared, the one about time. Um, so I thought that that was kind of funny, so I decided to put that in there. The last idea that I have for you guys is to repurpose packaging in your sketchbook. So for this page, I decided to draw Kermit the Frog sitting on a couch, and then I took this brown paper bag and I cut out a square from it, and I wrote a quote by Kermit the Frog on it, and this was on Kermit the Frog's Instagram. The quote says, if you're having trouble finding your smile today, look under the couch cushions. Even if you don't find your smile, finding all that loose change should make you grin. So thank you guys so, so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed that video. And if you did, make sure to give it a thumbs up. And as always, make sure to subscribe for more videos just like this one. And make sure to follow me on Instagram. It is at WellerMegs. 
And yeah, I love you guys so, so much, and I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye!